Simplifying algebraic expression and combining like terms. Algebraic expression. In this presentation, you will learn about the parts of an algebraic expression, what like terms are, how to simplify algebraic expression by combining like terms. An algebraic expression is a mathematical phrase that uses numbers, variables, and operation symbols. 2x plus 7 is an example of an algebraic expression. A variable is a symbol that stands for one or more numbers. X and Y are examples of variables. An algebraic expression can be broken into different parts, including terms, variable, coefficient, and constants. 5X plus 3Y minus 8 are terms, numbers, variable, or the product of a number and a variable. 5X plus 3Y minus 8. 5 and 3 are the coefficients numerical factors of a term or the number before a variable 5x plus 3y minus 8 x and y are the variables symbols that represent numbers that are unknown or can change 5x plus 3y minus 8 negative 8 are the constants a term that has no variable or a number by itself to simplify an algebraic expression means to make it simpler in other words we write the expression in the most compact way without changing the value of the expression. It's like organizing the expression and make it neater. Example number 1. 2x plus 3y minus 5x plus 4y. So, we need to group them together to simplify it easier. It will become 2x minus 5x plus 3y plus 4y. We will now subtract and add like terms so we left with negative 3x plus 7y. Good morning class. Today we are going to go on simplifying a algebraic expression. Can you tell me what it means? Jason, how about you? What do you think it means to simplify an algebraic expression? Um, it is like when you make the expression shorter. That's right. Simplifying an algebraic expression means to reduce to its simplest form by combining like terms. Let me, show, let me show you an example. Now we have two x terms, two way terms. Can we group them together? Great observation, Jericho. We can group the x terms and the y terms together. So, we have 2x two, two, two minus 5x plus 3y plus 4y. This one. What's the next step? We can add the x term together and the y term together. Exactly. So, we have 3x, negative 3x plus 7y. That's the simplest form of the expression. Let's try this example. Okay, let's see what you got. This is what's your answer. To be. Great job, this is, and how do you get that? Added the 4a, 2a, and negative 6a together to get 0a, and then I added the negative 3b, positive 5b together to get 2b, so we're left with 2b. Excellent to simplify algebraic expression can take some practice, but once you get out of it, it will become a second paper. Okay, do you have any questions about this topic? Yeah, I'm still a bit confused about 
identify that purpose. Okay. To identify it, like terms are in the terms that of the same variables. Say a component, example. Three x squared and five five x squared are like terms, but three x squared and five x cubed are not like terms. Does that does that make sense? And just have to the Bible. No problem again. Remember that if you have that question, you will put it back. Remember the lesson. Bye, Shay. Bye, Shay.